Hello and welcome, my name is Tinky Penguin and welcome back to Timberborn. Now if you remember last time, we... it took a couple tries but we finally got a colony that's actually starting to come together. We're not very far, but we will get very far, so... I think the first plan of today is to get some trees planted up because we have we have no lumber available honestly right now we're just really waiting on more beavers we can start planting some trees let's make sure we have the cut area correct let's get those destroyed we do not have a harvester at the moment harvester i mean a forester at the moment but we should very soon. Very, very soon. It's already nighttime again. Oh boy. Okay. I'm thinking of just growing maple. It takes the longest, but it gives us the most. It'll be slow, but after a while, it'll be it'll be good. So get those started up. I'm thinking of building a dam right through here so we can get a lot of water stored up. Because if we build it across right here. We can store up a whole nother like layer of water which would be so good to us i'll start i'll keep expanding the houses over here i'll probably start stacking them too honestly so right now we need wood we don't have hardly any wood actually we have no wood they can't get to these let's go over to here let's get some some gathering flags down so we can get some food because we actually have no more food we don't have anyone to work in the grill i need to figure out where everyone is going okay we only need one realistically actually no 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 keep both workers but we're gonna pause all of these so we can get other people in other places so we need someone to work in the foresting building it's not working though also need two people for the gathering flag grill okay i guess if someone's working at the grill we'll be fine okay we have one person at the gathering flag now which is what we need we have no food i need more people is the problem we had a little bit of a food crisis so that's why everything's kind of in shambles two and a half days left with 69 food and 80 water I think the water will be fine. The food will be very close. Later, when we have a bigger infrastructure built, we'll probably move on to wheat. It takes longer, but in the end, I think it gives us a better nutritional value. About three quarters of a day left in the drought, and I think we're doing just fine. We really need to get this dam built, but we need these trees also get planted and grown. But it'll take a while. So cool watching the green come back to this barren landscape. I think we're fine now. I don't think anyone's going to die of thirst or hunger, hopefully. Yeah, we definitely need a constant source of wood. Otherwise, our potato farm and system is not going to work. We have as much potatoes stored up as possible. We have 190 potatoes and we need to cook all that. Hopefully we can harvest these before the drought comes so we can get some food stored up and maybe two more of these built because we don't have enough of water storage and we are almost out of housing as well. We have a lot of potatoes stored up. We just can't cook them yet. I'm going to have to start a carrot farm. Probably do that over here. Let's mark out a little area for all the crops. We still have some in here? We do. Okay, perfect. They'll, they'll get us some berries in the morning. 20 adults our food and water demands are going up but we need to, the wood to build so many buildings that we need didn't realize how much of a challenge this would be i need to mark these for cutting as well keep forgetting that is a thing and they don't just automatically do that plenty of wood to cook the 300 potatoes that we have stored up if we cook all those that'll give us 1200 food let's throw some storage on the back side and we'll make these a lower priority but we'll pay, make these just just for carrots 0.4 days till the next dry dry season water depth meter that's would be very handy to have 
let's put that put that right there we don't have much more science points but let's get the double floodgate so i'm thinking actually hold on put some get rid of this put some stairs there then I'll see if I can't dam some of this, so it'll, it'll so it will stay like as a storage of water, maybe. I don't know. We'll have to see. We're getting our carrots though. Oh, boy! Oh boy! We have no more water. Thanks. We need two logs. Oh, damn. Oh goodness. I'm glad I got that carrot farm up in time. I think that's really saving us right now. Yeah, we have we have no more water. Um that's an issue. That is a big, big, big issue. I might replace these with floodgates so I can get some more water potentially stored up. If we're we're gonna lose a few people. I have no doubt in my mind. We have barely any food. Water's an issue. I'm trying to double our water storage, but it doesn't seem to be working that well. Oh my goodness. Point two days. They're dropping like flies. I need I need people working. Wow. This water needs to come back. We're done. Three people. Oh my goodness. Three people. We're still waiting for the water to come back. And it's nighttime. Just increase the working hours, please. Please, please, we need food. I mean, water. We need water. We took a beating on that one. Oh my goodness. It's going to be a while. Uh, repopulate again. They died within two seconds. That was That was insane. Oh, I don't know how this is going to work now. I don't have the people to do other things that I need done. Let's see. Um, for science points. I'm, I'm not sure. We're getting the food and water we need. I'm going to reduce their hours of working. Let's see. We build a double floodgate right along here. I think we can store some water. Wow, that was that was intense. Definitely. Well, on the brighter side of things, since. Oh, wow, that can reach there, actually. Okay, so we're still getting potatoes. We need to prioritize carrots. Carrots. Prioritize the carrots. Oh, my goodness. Hopefully, we can repopulate soon. Now we have four adults. Okay. Where can I put one person to work? The lumberjack flag. We need that wood. So is it two people in each? It is. Thank goodness. See, is this getting replanted? I don't think so. Okay, I see. I see what they're doing. And they're maxed out on carrots, so they'll keep harvesting a little bit of potatoes that they can't. He's getting the wood. And then, what is our priorities looking like? Honestly, it's those. It's only take 15 per. Actually, pause you. Resume you. Hoping we can get these built. Which, I believe we can. It'll just be a slow process. We're slowly, slowly coming together really only need one person at the farmhouse right now since we don't really have the storage to do anything 
let's build both. Just store them to carrots. Put two people on farming the carrots, and then we can get some food stored up. Because we're going to have another drought here really soon, and we need the food. It'll be a slow building up process, but once we get more people, it'll go quicker and quicker and quicker. Just happy we were able, able to save it just by the skin of our teeth, but we were able to save it. So it's wonderful. I think we'll be, I think we can rebuild just fine though. I think I just started everything a little too late. So the thirst was a problem. I need to get the storage up though. No doubt about that. We should have plenty of water for five people for however long this may be, but the droughts are getting longer. And with this little people, it's hard to keep this place going. Let's take one of you out, one of you into the forester, and get these trees growing again. They take a long time, so get as much food as we can. We're going at it, so let's actually take away one person here. Let's resume that. Gather some berries. I mean, we can store 400 carrots. Which will hopefully be the plan. We'll have to see. Droughts in in the morning. Starting another dry season. It's gonna be rough. The drought has ended. And we did just fine. As expected. We don't have that much people, so the demands for food and water ain't that great. But now we'll get our water back. And I did get a water depth meter built during the drought. So we can now monitor that, which is awesome. Not like I can do anything about this anyway. I am putting a double floodgate in though. So maybe we can source some water up here and slowly fill this up a, a little more. I might replace the dams down here with some floodgates as well. Got six adults. So we're, we are slowly repopulating. We are getting there. And we have one guy going at it on the lumberjack flag. Harvesting all the trees. So we're getting wood to build all the other things we need to build. Like this dam, for example, is now built. Let's put another water marker there. We are at a 0.67 water level. I feel like we could raise it a little more. Once all this is harvested, I'll put someone back on the forester so it's all growing at the same time i know it's not efficient but it looks nice okay don't judge me yeah i'm just gonna see if we can get that done as quick as possible because that's gonna that's gonna take a while to get all that harvested now we have our second dam built here so this will all be fine during the droughts at least for a little bit i'll probably still have to turn off the pumps but hopefully by then our water storage is doubled so we'll we'll have to see. We'll have to wait and see. Seven adults. Open another lodge back up. We're getting tons of carrots. Absolute tons of carrots. We might have to start stacking lodges on each other. Let's actually let's get a platform. We'll put let's hold on. Let's cancel that. And then on top, let's put two more this will strictly be just for carrots you can never have too much storage so we actually almost reached the max storage for how much carrots we can hold and i think eventually we'll expand down here with some more farms too but we'll have to wait and see till we get more people and we have two builders going at it building everything that we can
Yep. And hopefully that'll allow us to store some more water. But again, we'll wait and see. It's looking good so far. Plenty of food, plenty of water. Could have more water. It's getting built eventually. Let's actually prioritize these pretty high so they can just get built in and out of the way. Those will get built pretty fast, I think. And that'll allow our one guy pumping water to store as much as he can. That'll give us, I think, 320 total for storage. Probably a little more, considering I think we can store some in here and in the buildings. So we'll have to wait and see. Oh, we're up to 10 people. Awesome. We are repopulating. Fantastic. Everything seems to be going swellingly. And I'm thinking right here how many can i fit just oh i can fit i can fit one more i can fit one more where is it boom fit three storages here for potatoes actually two storages for potatoes and one for cooked potatoes so this will empty all this for other stuff. We have wood here. For 180 wood, which is probably plenty. Now we have plenty of water storage too. Awesome. We are advancing quite well. We're up to 10 people now, which is amazing. We are getting there. We are getting there. I didn't realize how long it took them to cut down all these trees. I guess that's a lot of logs, huh? Each each one of these gives us eight logs, so that is plentiful. A bunch of logs when we get back. I'm only going to make them work 16 hours so they have more leisurely time so we can make more babies. Because we need, we need people, like badly. So many things that are shut down right now because of the lack of people. But we are getting, we are getting back into the swing of things. We don't need this farmhouse up right now, so I'm not even going to worry about that. However, let's... We don't, we don't have a food problem. Here, let's just get two water pumps on right now and just fill up the storages. And then I'll bring it back down to one. Want to be prepared as possible. We can fill those the quicker, the better. This will just strictly be for potatoes, so. And then I think we're slowly, slowly getting these built. Can I, can, can you walk on these? Oh, I don't think I can actually. Huh. That is interesting. Very, very interesting actually. I'll probably need the, the triple platform. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to take you and put you on the adventure. We could, we need some, we need science points. Oh, two unemployed people. Two inventors. Perfect. And then. Okay. So. Nothing but potatoes. Perfect. Two hundred potatoes. Then for these, potatoes are no more. All 
I'm sure they'll get transferred very soon. Hopefully very soon. Transfer goods between warehouses when idle. Yes. Let's get you going as well. Do not hurt. We have a lot of carrots. Should not be maxed out though. We're not. Perfect. We're getting plenty of everything. We are, our population is growing exponentially now. I say exponentially, it's, it's growing a lot quicker now. Now that we have more than four people. Everything is looking up from here. I think it's going swell. We needed, we need to utilize this bottom space for something. Get all of this knocked out and taken care of. And we'll make something happen down here. Might be another extended tree farm. I don't know. We'll have to see. Not quite sure what to do with this bottom area yet. I don't want to just fill it with farm, although that would be kind of nice. I don't think it's what we need. I think we have plenty of food. But maybe a tree farm. I don't know. Kind of two tree farms adjacent from each other. It's getting closer to being full. It's a good problem to have. Ooh, we have three children now. Awesome, amazing, perfect. And we're getting the science points we need. Can I get this? Not quite. I think we just need platforms, realistically. Yeah, I'll put platforms here. And... Let's, let's delete these. Build my single platform right there. That built. We need more planks. Okay. Let's get you going and you going. We need more planks. One more person has grown up. Lovely, lovely. And we can also get our triple platform. Oh, not enough science points. Huh. Oh, wait, no. I don't need the triple. I don't know what I'm doing. I need the double. Like. Like so. These take planks and logs. Which I believe we are making. Yes. Yes, we are. Let's put all the grilled potatoes we can in here. Hold your horses. Oh, we need planks. Yes, yes, we need planks. Oh, in point seven days. Okay. We need two pumps going and get as much water as we can as quick as we can gonna pump two more hours into their work day so we can get the max amount of water we can because i generally generally want to shut these off so we still have water for all the plants more people are being born we're up to 18. this is fan Fantastic. The drought has started. Fortunately, I could not get my floodgate system in place, but that's okay. Not too worried about it. Still gonna pump water as much as we can. A lot more than we had last time. Okay. It's time to pause. Two unemployed people. Let's get two more builders going and just get stuff built. See what we can do during this drought.
the drought has ended. What in the world? Oh, it just hasn't been built yet. Okay. We are up to 22 people now. And I'm actually running out of room for wood, which is a good problem to have. And we're starting to cook the potatoes. I think, yeah, we're starting to cook the potatoes. We're going to start up. And we're starting to harvest the potatoes as well. It's We're back in business. And we have plenty of science points now. Let's get the triple watch. Oh my god, that is massive. Holds nine people. Might have to get rid of some of these. And... Oh yeah. This fit very nicely. Now we have a bigger embodiment of water. Which is awesome. Awesome. As ever. Water level could be a little higher. But it's not terrible. Not terrible whatsoever. Alright, we have made it back about to where we... Actually, we were much farther than where we were when we started this. We did lose a lot of people, but we have them all back and we are more established and have a bigger security blanket than ever i say that and my water's almost gone not a problem though they'll pump when they wake up shouldn't be an issue we'll be fine anyways i think i'm gonna stop the video there thank you guys so much for stopping by if you enjoyed the video please subscribe like the video, leave a comment down below, see what other games you want me to play in the future, any tips or tricks for this game in particular. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.